Well, good evening to you and uh, welcome on this most perfect evening for a game of football. Conditions are absolutely splendid and the folk of this town have come out in their droves for this match. Why wouldn't they? It is an ideal circumstance for what could be an ideal game. Everybody has been attracted to it. It has been the talk of the town and uh, the buses have been packed. Double-decker buses lining up outside. Coaches have carried thousands of away supporters here too and uh, all of it adds up to make a terrific, a crackling atmosphere. The match, I think, will be quite a spectacle. This stadium has that feel of a genuine coliseum. It could only be Rome. And we're underway. Hoists it forward. Bastoni. Barrera. Brozovic. Brozovic drives it forward. Has a goal! Fair effort. He reacted well. No, that was a slick move, and there were several options in the box to, uh, to pick out. get the pass he's looking for dinks one in nice little chip and out to safety and here's Jacko Chalanolu tries lift he's gone for it well that is rather wayward oh look I don't want to sound too dismissive but from here that looks the harder thing to do Tony hits it back. Chalhanolu. And here's Martinez. Hits one! Goal! Inter! And Inter go in front. Oh, beautifully dispatched. There was no reaching that. Well, I think two keepers would have had a hard time keeping that one out, never mind one. There was real venom in the strike and, and clear composure from the placement. Into Milan, they have an early lead. Good start. Looks to bypass the midfield. He's got through. Simeone! Good stop, that wasn't easy. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. has certainly made things interesting. 
Well, I think the players will be buoyed by the fact that they've managed to level things in a hurry. Tails most definitely up now. Brozovic. Correa's cross. We can get that clear. That's a good throw at all, really. He's given away possession cheaply. Gunter. Midway through the first period, and it's looking quite a game here. Bastoni. Barrera passes it forward. Right through the middle. Silvestri can claim that. And it's Simeone. He's on his way. Done very well to intervene. And there's a long ball. That's beautifully weighted. Simeon gets into a dangerous position. Finds himself eased off the ball. And it's played forward. Oh, good interception. That's a foul. Simple decision for the referee. Stefan de Vrij. Barrera tries to dink it in. Defending of the desperate variety. Keeper has beaten it away. Brozovic goes for it. Oh, that's a fine save. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. Tries to get it clear. And it's Brozovic. Correa gets the chance to cross. Silvestri catches it safely. And the first half is done. So, a very watchable game so far. Action at both ends and the team's level. So, both teams heading off for the break. An interesting game has brewed up here. Hoping perhaps for a little bit more from both parties in the second half. But the score at half-time is 1-1. So, we're just settling back into this second half. Inter clearly have been the better side for me. Yeah, I know the score doesn't quite reflect it. But if they go about their game in the, in the same manner as the opening 45 minutes, things really should improve. Meza tries to get it forward quickly. Skrinja tries to stroke it through. He's played him through. Checo. And here's Martinez. And the shot! Inter! And they're back in front! And that is about as cool as they come. He picked his spot expertly. Now that's what I call finishing, right in the corner. He knew instinctively who was where and didn't need to waste any time weighing things up. That's a cracking goal. Inter Milan take the lead. Simeone 
desperately wants to get on the end of this. Bastoni drives it forward. Hit long and direct. And that's been levered clear. Chalanolu shoots. Ah, oh, that's great defending to cover for the goalkeeper and just get something in the way. Back to the keeper and go again. Hoists it high. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. There really wasn't very much in that. Not far away from being a telling final ball. Ah, quality deserted them when they really needed it. Chalhanolu. He goes long. Tries to get it clear. Chalhanolu needed to come up with... Hits one! Goal! A two-goal lead and they're firmly in control. Uh, it's a keeper's nightmare, Peter. He just couldn't pick up on it until it was way too late, having so many bodies in front of him. So the lead now is two. Listen, it's up to them now how they think about it from here, because for me it's crying out for them to force the issue. Keeper's got good distance on that. Looks to thread it through. Uh, ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. Oh, shooting chance! there to hoof it away and it's Jekko Jekko that's good defending very good defending goes direct to the front line Chalanolu Perisic. Two minutes to be added on. Played into space out wide. Oh, that had to be more accurate. Added time is up, and there goes the whistle. Inter Milan have won it. As much industry as inspiration. Whatever the formula, it has worked for them. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen?